Okay, now I'm going to show you how Hello, to uh, I want access, to uh, show you how uh, your uh, website uh, to set a one up. Use I click on the MUS here in my dashboard. Um, the administrator of the website. And you'll see that I already have one website already set up. All the different um, creases size here. So it's a little and essentially what we do is if we want now, to, to go into an existing the, site uh, we have multiple control use site over here. We so have to click on the button. site, and then when that happens, the you'll be able to check a box to actually activate um, that uh, MUS so option on, in your dashboard. Activate. Now, pause for a second. Now, and then I'll let's say you want to create. Okay, here website. we are in my dashboard. Well, the first thing you, you can do is you click here, on create a new website, and then you enter the domain name that will be used. So let's and, just uh, say I see want this, to create a website unless it's been activated. Call, so you have to make a request counseling uh, from Elise that you would like to that. have that done. Services. Those are the people I'm working with in India who just popped up. Dot com. Now this is the domain name plus the period and the ex dot and the extension. And then you save it. Now you can edit this if you want. Let's say you typed it in wrong. <clears throat> you can edit it. Okay, but we're just going to leave it. Um, you can also delete it. If you delete it, you can't get it back. Or you can go in and start um, creating content. Now let's take a look at the Panic and Anxiety Clinic. This is one that I created. Now I'm going to edit it here. Let's just do the little quick edit. And it doesn't matter so much, but I'm going to make that a capital C update it, and now we've created a site. In fact, I think I'll just stop here, and then we'll make a breaker video and start with a new one.